Tatay Kapuso. Pahiram po ng 20 minutes lamang ng inyong hapon. Ako po si Boy, and welcome to Fast Talk with Boy Abunda. Special po ang ating panahon ngayong araw. I met him when he was, what, 17 years old. Hindi pa ho siya artista. At, uh, but he, he was a young boy with dreams. Today, he's one of the biggest superstars in the country. Pero, napakabuti pa rin po ng puso. Nanay, tatay, kapuso, please welcome Alden Richard. Maraming salamat, Richard. Alden. <laughs> maraming, maraming salamat. Si Tito Boy po kasi hindi talaga sanay tawagin akong Alden. Eh. He always calls me by my first name. Pero Tito Boy, when you called me for this, hindi talaga ako nag-hesitate to say yes. Maraming salamat. Yes po. Alam niyo po ba, that at 17, I could have been Alden's first manager. Yes po, totoo po. Diba? Yes, Pero maraming salamat. At sa katatin, pag-uusapan niyan in another interview. Yes, Tito Boy. Let's do the fast talk. Yes po. You ready? <laughs> we have two minutes, and the two minutes begin now. RJ Tisoy. RJ. Tisay Morena. Morena. Mukha o katawan? M katawan. Landian, kulitan. Kulitan. Pangmatagalan, panandalian. Pangmatagalan. <laughs> Matamis o manghang. Manghang. Witty or funny? Funny. Yakap o halik? Yakap. Relo, kotse? Relo. Gamer, lover? Both! <laughs> Single player, multiplayer. Multiplayer. Bukod sa pisngi, saan ka pa may dimples? Wala na po. Bubu ka ng team. Name three celebrities na gusto mong makalaro. Uh, si Raver Cruz, Miguel Tan Felix, at Shira Diaz. Pinakamatigas sa parte ng katawan mo? Uh, chest. Hello, goodbye. Hello. Uh, amin o itatago? Amin. We will raid your room. Sinong nandoon? Wala po. <laughs> what turns you on? Uh... Mabuting puso. Tuwing kailang ka sweet. Pag may kailangan. <laughs> Huling beses kang kinilig. Ang tagal na, Tito Boy. Huling beses kang nakipag-date. Last year? <laughs> Your biggest rejection. Wala po. Kung kasalanan ka, ano ka? Uh, uh, hindi ko po alam. One thing you can sacrifice for love. Myself. Bibigyan ka ng award. You're the best blank. Best person. If your love life is a movie, bigyan mo ng title. Kailan? <laughs> lights on, lights off. Lights on. Happiness or chocolates? Happiness. When is the best time for happiness? All the time. Yes or no? In love ka ba ngayon? No. Allah. <laughs> Alam niyo kung bakit ako natawa kanina? Hmm. Usap lang tayo. Meron tayong makukuha dito. <laughs> maraming salamat. Thank you. Maraming, maraming, maraming salamat. Diyan ka lang yes, dahil uh, mahaba pa ang ating pagsasamahan. Samantala for today's talk, mga kaibigan, ito ang nangyari, Alden at Nanay, Tatay, Kapuso. Um, patuloy ang speculations. May mga usapan sa uh, mga posts, social media at uh, mga dyaryo na di umanoy si Kylie Padilla ay may bagong boyfriend. So ang ginawa ng uh, Fast Talk with Boya Bunda ay tumawag ko kami sa Sparkle. We wanted to find out kung totoo nga ba o hindi. Ang statement ng Sparkle ay Kylie Padilla is not in a relationship. Ito ang akin. Uh, Kylie, if you're watching, invited ka dito sa Fast Talk with Boya Bunda para mag-usap tayo, para iklaro natin ang mga issues na ito. Bakit? Nanggaling po ito sa mga posts ni Kylie noong New Year's Eve. She was in Thailand, confirmed. And meron siya mga posts na may silhouette ng isang uh, kaibigang lalaki. Maaring kaibigan, di ba? Merong uh, naka-holding hands. Merong naka-profile na, na mga posts. And the question is, boyfriend nga ba o kaibigan lamang? The only person who can answer this is Kylie Padilla. So Kylie, if you find time, you're welcome dito sa Fast Talk with Boya Bunda para maiklaro mo. Maraming maraming salamat, Sparkle, at salamat, Kylie. Samantala, maya-maya lamang mga kapuso, nanay, tatay, mag-uumpisa na po ang aming pag-uusap ni Richard, ni Alden. Yes, po. Um, pero ito muna, para lang uh, gusto ko ito mailabas uh, sa aking uh, puso. <laughs> okay, sabi na kasi kanina, uh, when was the last time you dated? Last time. Hmm? Di totoo yan, ha? may alam ako sa'yo. Anyway, <laughs> pero hindi ko na sasabihin. Una, Last November, you had a press conference in Cebu. Yes, in recent, ito yung kasagsagan ng uh, main uh, Alden, Aldab uh, issue. 
you made a statement nang sabi mo ay nobody controls my life walang nagdidikta uh, i made I, i made my own choices i made my own decisions ang tanong ko doon Alden anong pinanggagalingan mo at bakit mo nasabi ang iyong nasabi pangalawang tanong are you dating now yes or no ang mga kasagutan po sa pagbabalik ng Fast Talk with Boy Abuna. Kami na babalik po dito sa Fast Talk with Boy Abunda. Kasama po natin si Alden Richards. Alden, maraming maraming salamat. Thank you. Tuloy ko na yung tanong. Apo. November of last year, there was this press conference in Cebu, uh, kasagsaga ng isyo nga ng uh, Aldab. And then you made that statement. Um, I'm not a property of anyone. Nobody controls me. I make my own decisions. I make my own choices. Galit ka nun. At uh, I want to know, saan ang pinanggagalingan nun at bakit nasabi mo ang iyong nasabi? Well, Tito Boy, uh, since I started being a public figure, when I started in the industry po, parang uh, may, as I grow older, may nakikita po akong cycle. Like, pag celebrity ka, you always cater to what people want. Parang, of course, especially to uh, lahat ng feedback sa'yo. Pinakikinggan mo to appease them para ma mabigay mo yung gusto nila. And at a certain point, dito boy, medyo nakakapagod din pala siya. Parang ano po eh, uh, dumating po ako sa point na when I was really burned out with all of these demands and, and things that people want from me, parang When I stepped out and looked into the bigger picture, wala na po akong identity. Hmm. Parang, nasa na yung ano ko? Nasa na yung pagkatao ko? Parang, lagi na lang ba akong susunod sa sinasabi ng ibang tao? Sus of course, sa gusto ng mga tao na makita sa akin. Napagod lang po ako dun sa point na yun, Tito Boy. And, um, Parang I wanted to be firm. I, I, hindi po ako galit when I said that. I, I just wanted to be firm with the current state of mind that I that I have now. Did you try to communicate this with your fans? Um, I think isa yung mga, yung mga supporters ko ngayon dito, boy, is the best supporters I can have in this lifetime in my career. All right. Kasi no matter how or no matter what I do or... Uh, kung ano man po yung gusto kong gawin, they always support me 100%. Because I'm coming from, uh, yung, yung, yung intention ko dun is always pure po. I'll, I'll go straight to the question. Dahil meron pa rin naniniwala, magpahanggang sa ngayon, I think, na kasal kayo ni Maine, meron kayong anak ni Maine, what do you want to say? Um, I think everything po is already self-explanatory. Uh, ulitin ko po, uh, during the Aldab era, Nagpapasalamat po kami sa lahat ng support ang binigay niyo po sa amin. And sa lahat po ng pagmamahal at um, you know, masaya po kami na napasaya namin kayo. But right now po kasi kami po ni Maine ngayon, we're at a point na we're not getting any younger and we've already made our, of course, personal choices. Okay. Um, and we're very good friends up to this point. We talk. Wala kayong anak at hindi kayo kasal. Wala po. Yan ang importante. That Wala has po. to be categorically stated. Yes diba? po. Wala po. I'll take it from there. I'll build uh, on it. Sabi mo nga, uh, you've made your choices. May kanya-kanya kayong buhay. You have become very, very good friends. I'll then, I was doing research for this very short interview. Ang dami kong nadaanan sa showbiz, 12 years. Ang dami mo palang uh, na-link ng mga leading ladies. <laughs> Luis de los Reyes. Uh, Sam Pinto, who found you young, my Win-Win Marquez, meron mga Andrea Torres, my Julie Ann, my Sanya Lopez. Pero sa tagal ng panahon na ito, wala kang dininay, wala kang tinanggap. Oo, hindi ka nagka-girlfriend ng artista. Hindi po. Hindi ka nagka-girlfriend. Pero, ito tanong. Ako naman ang kausap mo. Yes po. Kasi sinabi mo kanina na uh, last time you dated was about a year ago. Eh, hindi ako naniniwala. Inuulit ko ang katanungan, Alden. Yes or no, are you dating somebody now? No po. Hindi. Hindi po. Um, when was the last time you dated? Yun nga po, ito parang since fast talk, nasabi ko na lang last year, but it was very uh, a long time ago. I... I ang 
for me po kasi ang dating, the, uh, my, my very own definition of it is you, you go out, tapos you spend time together. Uh, ngayon po kasi, of course, may mga nakakatext here and there, but I really don't consider that as dating. It's maybe, okay. It's maybe more on mingling lang po. And, you know, hindi, hindi naman po porket single, eh, you're not available. And you are available. I am very available. Sa lahat po. ng mga artista na naling sa'yo, sino yung muntik mong maging girlfriend? Ito naman, tayo lang dalawa. Uh, yes po. Eh. Oo, di ba? Sino yung muntikan lang? Dalawa po eh. Dalawa. <laughs> Sino? Si Winwin po and Julie. Okay. Okay. Winwin, bakit hindi natuloy? Um, for some reason po, because of work, busy siya, busy rin po okay. ako. Um, si Julie, bakit hindi natuloy? That was my, it was my fault po, Tito Boy. Parang, uh, I decided to mag-focus uh, na lang po talaga muna sa work. And, okay. Yun po yung, hining, hiningi ko po ng sorry yun sa kanya. It was a long time. A long time of, uh, uh, parang, naiwan ko po siya. Okay. And, uh, I'm sure, if she's watching right now, na, alam niyo man po na, sabihin ko na po, I never told anyone this. Um, uh, yung part po kasi kay Julian, yun po yung parang pinaka- Mabigat. And then when we were doing Sunday Pinasaya that time, we since that time that we separated po, ang tagal po namin hindi nag-uusap. Like a se seven year, seven year, seven years almost, almost ganun po katagal. Okay. And then, naniniwala po kasi ako na time really heals everything. And uh, mahirap po kasing ipilit eh. Na, gusto mo na magkaayos kayo, pero yung, yung panahon, hindi pa tama. Kasi sariwa pa po yung sugat eh. And hindi po natin madidikta sa puso natin kung kailan gagaling yun. It's, it really depends upon the person. But you guys are okay? Very much po. So Sunday pinasaya dito boy. Uh -oh. At rehearsal, um, nung may green room po tayo sa, sa Studio 7, nung kami na lang pong dalawa sa green room, nila ko po yung pinto. And then I talked to her. Uh, I'm really sorry for what happened. Uh, iniwang kita. And um, there's no one to blame but me. And sana napatawad mo na ako. And then, okay po siya kausap that time. And then, ang pagtapos uh, po nung usapan yun, na parang may ibang relief po sa... Sa kalooban. Sa kalooban, na parang yeah. for the longest time, iniiwasan ko rin po siya. Pero nung nangyari yung moment na yun, may dala pala rin ako. Okay. And then, now, we're very much good friends po. Salamat, Alden. Wala. For sharing this story with us. Hindi ko po sinasabi kahit kanino yun. Thank you. Maraming maraming salamat. Huling katanungan. Naalala ko, uh, noong nakilala kita, bata ka pa, ayaw naman talaga, parang, no, you, you wanted to be an actor, but I knew that, I remember that you wanted to be a pilot. Yes, po, Dito Boy. Mama mo pushed you to be an actor. He, she was actually encouraging you. Yes, po. To be an actor. She's probably up there just watching us, proud of what you have become. Superstar ang nako, pero hindi na babago ang puso. Anong nais mong sabihin sa mama? You know, Tito Boy, uh, whenever I get interviews and talk about my mom this past few interviews, hindi na po ako nagiging emotional. I just don't know why now. Uh, minsan po, pag eh, nagagawa ko mga bagay na successful, ini-imagine ko po minsan yung Yung nanay ko nanonood. Yung nanay ko kasama ko sa backstage. Siya yung katabi ko sa upuan. Tapos habang pinapanood po namin yung mga bagay na ginagawa ko or 
laging siya nasa VIP seat ng mga concerts ko or VIP seats ng, ng mga pelikula ko. Ah. Ang sakit-sakit dito, boy. Ang sakit pong ma-realize na yung taong may gusto nun para sa'yo, siya yung wala. Kaya, ano na lang po eh. I see to it that all the things that I, uh, that I do, I dedicate it to my mom. So that, alam ko po kung pagpagod na ako, pag ayoko na, pag masyado na akong, ah, uh, gusto ko na lang umalis sa industriya because of this burnout. We we experience burnouts po every now and then. You get to ask yourself eh. Bakit ka ba nagsimula? That's the question I always ask myself. And then ang laking tulong po nun sa akin. Bakit ka nagsimula? At ang sagot ay it's because of my mom po. Hmm. Salamat, Talde. Maraming maraming salamat. I'm sure she's out, up there. Proud of what you have become. Thank you po, Tito Boy. Kami nga lang na kilala ka, nag-umpisa ka, pero hindi ka nabago ng panahon at hindi ka nabago ng kasikatan. Mag-iingat ka. You take good care of yourself. Thank you po, Tito Boy. Mahal na mahal ka ng napakaraming tao. And that includes us. Thank you maraming maraming salamat. Thank you po. Maraming salamat. We need another conversation. Yes po. We yes, need po. another conversation. Kulang puto. Okay. Kulang na kulang. Okay? Yes, Maraming po. salamat. Maraming salamat. Oh, thank you so much. Diyan ka muna. Magpapaalam lang ako sa kanila. Opo naman. Nay, tay. Maraming maraming salamat. Susunod na po ang underage. At maraming salamat muli sa inyong pagpapatuloy sa amin, sa inyong mga tahanan at puso. And always remember, be kind. Make your nanay and tatay proud. Hashtag say thank you. Let's talk again tomorrow. Goodbye for now. God bless.